There we go. Another crab's treasure. Let's continue. We were on the bridge to go to the big city. Under the sea. Hello. It's over. It's all over. Why ain't it ever me, you know? Oh, what's going on here? I'll tell you what's going on. I'm getting my carapace cracked by cruel, unfeeling forces beyond my control. Yet again. That's what's going on. I just spend my whole savings on rare trash you can only get in the shallows. So I could sell it at a profit in your casino, of course. And then use that profit to trade up my shell. Get myself something nice, you know? And now I come back here and the bridge to the city is completely collapsed. There's no way I can make it back without leaving all this trash behind. It's all over, man. I'm fully shocked. I'll be shellless within the tide. Oh, I guess I'd better find another way around if I want to get to the city. Thanks for the sympathy, pal. Sorry. I mean, what do you want me to say? You're shocked. I can just go down there. Can I? There's no fall damage in this, uh... There is fall damage in this game. <laughs> I thought I could just go there. <laughs> but we're... <laughs> Shit. Okay. <laughs> well, don't mind me, I guess. We're <laughs> going down here. <laughs> oh, come on, man. This game. <laughs> just, I just got the biggest middle finger from the game. It's like, it's bad. Stainless relic. A workable piece of metal. Maybe something can turn it into something useful. Huh? It... what? But we don't have other weapons, so... Ooh, the reef's edge. Nice. What is this? It's a shell. It's a sauce nozzle. Got less defense, but a lot higher um, shielding potential. And it looks absolutely god awful. Like something stuck in my butt. With a little piece of it come, uh, you know, going out of the back. Oh, that's bad. Before we proceed, though, there is something I wanted to do. Because I forgot about something. Let's do a shadow portation and go to the central shallow. Because I did leave that one boss behind. And I feel like I want to... Get to the boss? I don't know how, or I don't remember where it was, but... I'm sure I can figure it out. It was this way. Roughly. Was it further back? It was that big guy that almost one-shot me. Okay. I don't know what's happening. I don't feel safe around here. <laughs> I got hit. 
Unbelievable. How did that happen? just happened oh hey, hey. What? actual fuck man <laughs> that's I, I don't think that's supposed to happen but <laughs> it's fine where am I Oh, I dodged the wrong way. How do I, uh, I forgot how to eat. Okay, R. -R. Okay. This is not the castle, is it? This is another castle. All this, like, the Q tip police. I hate these guys. Flip in heck did I just do? Locked. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was about to get smashed. We have a coconut. Coconut did slow me down quite substantially last time, so I don't think I want it. YouTube guy can go in from that side. Really? I'm not doing great. Oh, there's another one of those guys. Hell yeah, dude, the party hat. Party hat is a really good hat. I know that much. Okay, I think we can get in from here, maybe. There we go. Uh, platforming is, like, not good. <laughs> the, the, the camera is always in a really bad spot. Oh, no. No. Also, it's... Stink you won't believe this, but it's incredibly slippery in the ocean. Almost like everything is wet, you know? It's wild. I don't know how that happens. Oh, one of the blows are lib. Nice. Amazing how that cobble survives. Amazing how cobble survives at all in here. Yeah.
I think we're done. Wait, why are these? This is what I... Oh, shit. Dude, what's happening? It's not going well, guys. This just looks like a freaking treasure was hidden down there. What just happened? Oh my good lord. What is this? Wait a second. This is where I started? Is it though? Uh, I'm not pretty sure. Wait, can I? Don't I have a teleporting power? Oh no, teleportation! It, I, I can't go back to the base or to like the moon shell, the moon snail shell. I can only travel to points I've already visited, but I can't, like, fast travel back. I feel like I've seen this before. been here before all right let's just go in a bit of extra life probably a good idea and uh, go back to the central shallow I swear to god we have to find that stupid boss I don't know. I have a feeling it's this way, but... Is it closer to the castle, maybe? No, that way was the captain, wasn't it? It was further back. Almost at the very start of the level, I think. I feel like open spaces like this are harder to navigate from memory. Yeah. Also, there's not many like recognizable landmarks. Oh, hold up. There's a way back. That will lead me to the treasure, so I'll, I'll go take that. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> I failed miserably. At the platforming. Well, that's no surprise. I have to wait longer before I uh, look in.
Very good. And now I somehow have to make it over there. I don't know if I can. Nope, that doesn't work. I think I have to. I might have to use the way that gets me there to go to the other side. But I'm not entirely sure because it's right there. I actually have no idea how to get up here. Okay, I think it's this way now. Oh, there's also this, which is... What the fuck? There's also this that is relatively new. Oh, god. Okay. Let's see. I dodged. Dude, the, the, it's bad. So I think the guys that have the purple glowing eyes are the ones that drop the extra crystals. Those are the ones that we need to kill. I cannot believe that that just happened to me. I missed and then I got stuck backtracking. Yeah, the, the camera clipping when it's too far, that's a problem. The hat is about to break, but I don't really have any alternatives. And I think this was the place with the boss. Oh shit. Yeah, there it is. Okay, that was bad. <gasps> that was so much damage. <laughs> so much damage. I don't remember how to use my big claw power. The fuck is that? Flat. Oh God. 
healing, guys. win holy shit no the umami i'm using it that's control uh it, it's like the i have the chunk of plastic and a ship of crap oh it's a thousand much plastic okay uh i'm talking about the adaptation adaptation q okay Ooh, that was rough. Honestly, is that it? I kill this guy for glory and for a thousand microplastic, <laughs> I suppose. All right, fair enough. Time to proceed. Time to move forward. And that is going to bother me so much, by the way. Can I not? Wait, 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 wait. Dude, I don't know. I really don't. When does the combat music start playing? What do you mean? I feel like a nail will do much more damage than a little fork, but what do I know? All right, let's move on. New Carcina on the reef edge. Okay. Carcinia? Carcinia? Cur Came from there. Going this way. I don't really like the, the spinning top thingy. The fuck just happened. What is going on here? Seahorse? Oh, it's dead. They haven't. I think they have Tic Tacs. What the hell are they gonna do with Tic Tacs? This guy has a shot glass. And is that like a like an olive thingy? The toothpick? Is the fizzle is good. I mean, it doesn't do that much damage, but oh, what the? oh, okay. Yes. Shit. 
Oh, there's another one. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, that's a thimble. Fortify. Oh, that looks like a like a solid shell. What the fuck, man? Don't. <laughs> so rude. I don't trust this at all. Oh, yeah? Wait, oh, this is bad. Oh, this is really bad. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no, no. I guess I got here to the shortcut. But I feel like there was still more stuff up out here. What the hell is that guy? Is that a big hammer? with crazy eyes jeez okay one down two down That me there dodge though. Okay. A C star. What was the C star for? That's a good weapon. I think I've done this in reverse. I was not supposed to come here. I was supposed to jump down from up top. Get to this side. Let me get a, a new thimble. I like the word thimble, by the way. It's a good name for a character as well. And then I was supposed to go back from there, this way. Hmm. Alright. Okie doke. Serious? Oh. <laughs> I actually hate that guy. 
I like kill that guy. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. Ain't no way that guy just did that. That it truly felt like an Anor Londo moment. Real Arnold Londo moment, guys. Like I got shot, but oh, what the? What do I? I have to throw something at this guy so it moves. Also, what is this cube? I feel like it's important. So, how do I... What's this? So that's fortify. The little shield. I don't know what it does. Not much, it looks like. Was I? How much? Get up there! I'm not sure I'm supposed to get up from there. That was a big mistake. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Awful death scream, by the way. I am tired of this shit. This is one god awful zone. Who the f flipping hell are you? Bablo. Hey there, pal. Do you like going fast? Uh, no, I hate it. <laughs> well, it's your unlucky day. Because you're going to need some wicked speed to get off the ramp down there. Walking ain't gonna cut it. There is sprinting even. No, sir. Oh, okay. That's where I come in. Pablo, five times snail racing league champ at your service. Had to give us snails our own league because we're so damn fast. Uh, okay. I'm gonna tell you how to get speed so insane. Your grandma's antenna will be twisting in her grave. Or maybe she's still alive. Sorry, there was a little insensitive either way. But trust me, this kind of crazy sh movement will peel your gills back. It will dry out your excess skeleton while you're still underwater. It will boil you in a damn shell. If you're not careful. Alright. And worst of all, it will turn you into a permanent speed demon who can't even form words if they're not moving at high velocity. Are you ready to accept that kind of risk? No. Because a lot of people say they are, and before you know it, bam, that takes it to speed. Like the drug? It happened to a lot of good critters down here. So I gotta ask one more time, you sure? Y yeah, why not? Okay, so basically, 
you're just gonna want to sprint towards the ramp and then press the block button. Oh, okay. Tennis ball. But, uh, hold on just a moment. What do I get for going here? What is this? Ain't no way I'm supposed to climb this. What is this? Nah, -uh. I'm not gonna die like this. I forgot how I got up there. Okay, like this. Alright, let's go. <gasps> oh shit. Damn, dude. That was epic. Let me use my uh, 5,000 microplastics. Level up twice. Look, I don't have enough damage, you know. The zones are so weird. I honestly don't really understand if I'm supposed to be doing something else, you know? But I made it to a new Corsina. They're asleep. Wake up. I don't want to go down there. I'm not getting speed, am I? <laughs> I don't think I am. Oh, hold up. No. <laughs> not even there. Oh, that's a uh, that's film. That's someone's cat and someone's dog. Yo, this is pretty cool. They made a bunch of... Uh, <clears throat> bunch of whiskey balls, basically. Hello. Let's see a fresh face in town. And right before Trash Day 2. What's Trash Day? Oh, he doesn't know. He doesn't know what trash day is. I couldn't spoil the surprise for you now. You know soon enough. They don't like surprises. And that is long complex history of Slag Tide's trade route with New Carcinia. Wow, I'm so glad I stuck around to learn all that lore. Thanks, Uncle Adi. Okay, great. Oh, 
domino pieces and a sponge. Wait, can we go in? That's an ashtray. Hello there. Um, hello, ma'am. Have you come from Slacktide? Which is usually reserved for traders, soldiers, or nobles. You don't look like any of those, dear. Unless perhaps you're one of those new nobles that chooses not to flaunt your wealth. How exciting. What's the Duchess court like? Is she as gorgeous as they all say? Yeah, she was. I, I mean, she's pretty. Uh, pretty crazy. You're not so bad yourself, little noble. Care to come up to my apartment? Uh, sh sure. Uh, have a nice day, man. <laughs> I freaked uh, my, my little guy freaked out. He's too young and pure for uh, the kind of debauchery that happens in New Cassinia. Welcome to New Cassinia, a beacon of civilization amongst the harsh violence of the sands between. A testament to the prevailing power of industry. The city of dreams, the big crab apple, and the defining pillar of the trash economy which supports all the crustacean society. How did I get into this conversation? My name you ask? No I didn't. I'm Tortellini, the town greeter, at your service. I'm beyond excited to greet two new visitors in a single day. Is that a lot? Not at all. You usually get 20 to 30. Then why? Wait, did you say two? Was it the one a shark carrying the coolest shell you've ever seen? Oh, friend of yours? Not at all. I've got to kick that guy's butt and get my shell back. Oh, a sworn enemy then. This day gets more exciting by the minute. I've got to catch him before he sells my shell to who knows who. Can you tell me where he went? Not at all. I greeted him with gusto and then didn't give him a second thought. What sort of town greeter would I be if I looked behind me to keep tabs on those I've already greeted, rather than facing forwards to greet those yet to come? Okay, okay, okay. Where would someone trying to sell a shell go then? I can think of exactly four places. They might have tried to sell it to the Shellfish Desires, the luxury store good. A uh, good store. If it's more of an antique shell, they may have gone to check the museum curator who might purchase it. Failing those, they might have visited Bottom Feeders, the dye bar in the lower crust. Try and pass it off to some piece of gutter trash. And finally, they could have gone to the back alley blacksmith and sell it for scrap. Okay, thank you so much. I'll check all those places out. Cold speed, small fry. Whether they could give you more of a tour. But my work is never done whilst there remain travellers left ungreeted. Cold speed, that was good. That got me. This place is huge. <laughs> Enamored with the sight of our fair city. I honestly say I've never seen anything like it. I should go and explore. But I'd say topside if I were a stay topside if I were you. The seabed can host some pretty sketchy characters. I mean I um, I feel like I'm pretty sketchy myself at this point. Which is like great. <laughs> CND Pharmacy. Looks like I spent a lot of money. I've just been unable to stop thinking about that awful business happening in the grove. Would you hush up and enjoy your kelp, Benedict? All this bleeding heart nonsense is ruining a brunch. Oh. That the egg and... Was it pasta? Noodles? You see the hermit over there? Isn't he so mysterious? The one standing uncomfortably close to us right now? Heavens no, not them. The mysterious blue one over the bar. Oh, please tell me you don't mean Firth. Tilapia went on a date with him, 
and he tried to get her to invest in sand dollars. You deserve someone better, Delphi. Some hard-working crab will treat you right. But it's just so mysterious. Wasn't Firth the guy, the trader? This guy? Well, hey there. Long time no see, fellow hustler. You're the guy from the bridge. Sure am. Firth's the name. Don't the road it, you know. You seem pretty happy. Didn't you just lose all your money? <laughs> of course not, pal. Not even close. I should invest and never put all these shells in one. I mean, it's all this boss in one shell, you know? What? And that's my goal in life. I get bots into shells. Specifically, my butt. And specifically, the fanciest, flashiest, most impressive shell I possibly can. You feel me? Not really. I'm a shell trader, kid. That's a hermit lot in life. Always looking to upgrade. So about the old shell for a better one. If you're smart, you get into business too. Into the business too. A whole ocean of opportunity could be passing you by, you know? Ready to start your journey? Get you in a flesh new shell. I think I'm okay, thanks. You lost kid. What can I actually trade for shells? No. Hello. Okay, that way we go down. Another profitable trash day is just ahead of yours truly. The hotel is booked to the gills with eager tourists and I don't even have to lift a pincer. Good for you. Hmm, disappointed. Alright, new shell found. There's a hook over there. Why? To get from one side to the other quick? I guess so. Uh, hello? Whoa, fancy looking dude. Welcome to Shellfish Desires, the flagship brick and mortar store of Shellfish Corporation. I goes with my visibly financially troubled friend. <laughs> Don't call me that. Is that obvious? It is. I suppose you've come up to the upper cross for a bit of window shopping. No shame in it. Let the folks pause on their way through town to take a look at our luxury shells. You've got five minutes before your paws become a loiter, so enjoy them while they last, my friend. Have you seen my shell? Did a big shot come into town and try to sell you a shell recently? Oh, we sure did. I told you to get stuffed. We don't do trade-ins here. And even if we did, I'd never take the kind of bit of junk he sold me. Not a clue where he went after that. Does nobody in this city pay any attention? Shell insurance. You can pay microplastic to insure any shell you've worn before. In the Moonstone shell, you can pick any insured shell to start with every time you respawn. Ooh, that is very cool. I don't know which one is a uh, is like a good one to have. Like, they all seem fairly different in both defenses, shield value, weight, ability. Like, there's so many combinations I couldn't say which one is good and which one isn't. So 45 grants you invincibility for the next three hits it blocks to your shell. That's actually not too bad. It's got decent defense. 
decent amount of shield. It does cost two, though. The party hat is pretty good, but we don't have the money. We have new shells, though. Couldn't kill you. The sort of excuse for a shell became flaccid and rubbery as soon as it entered the water. What's the point? That's pasta. I can eat that. Shuttlecock. The holes in the side increase both mobility and vision. I shall also for guerrilla combat. Twist the currents around to spin a high velocity. Okay, so that's the spin. Bartholomew. That's a good shell. Captures the likeness of a legendary pirate who once terrorized the shallow. Bombs away. Eject upwards from your shell and detonate it. Really massive damage to enemies in the blast radius. That breaks the shell, though. Felix Cube. It's very heavy. Little bro. Very heavy juggernaut. For brief, dura brief duration, withstand all interruption, all interrupts and knockdowns. You want no blocking. Piggy bank. Decoy. Abandon his shell and cause an enemy to attack it. Huh? A plush visage of a legendary traitor. Smokescreen. Your umami becomes a dense cloud of ink that causes an enemy to lose track of you. Huh. That's... That sounds sus. A baby shoe. Activated to receive another chance at life as long as the shell remains equipped upon death. Holy crap. That has a ton... 230 shield? That's insane. Trophy. Gorgeous eating bowl, often seen at upper class banquet. And it has the party time from... Uh, which is pretty good. Matryoshka. Okay. Rainbow Kravitalism. Oh, we can also... Like a poncho. Ivory poncho. <laughs> it's so krill, I like that. Cult leader. Oh, yeah. Is that... Um, is that Cult of the Lamb? That's a game I have to play at some point. Midnight. I like this. Made Krill. Oh god. I'm out. Good stuff though. Hello. Oh Jackson. Every day I find myself looking down wishing you were up here with me. Claw and claw. But I'd be crossed paths I was immediately smitten. But my family would never approve of me now with a commoner. But there's nothing common about you. Maybe one day I'll possess the courage to tell you. But until then, I shall yearn from afar. Damn. Better love story than Twilight. Hello? Look at that big stupid museum. What's the point of a whole building to store all crap from the past? But when they start shipping off objects from the future. True, man. Hey, can I go out this way? No. Oh, okay, okay, I'll go somewhere else. Sorry, I I'm sorry, I didn't mean to snap at you like that. I'm just under a lot of pressure, okay? People are not happy when they can't get to, op to the open ocean right now. They keep calling me names like phone the in-progress blocker and saying my fence is a lazy design. There's a good reason for it. Fresh Island is on its way here right now. If we kept all the avenues of, tra of transit open during trash day, it'd be a call damn ship show in here. Why can't all these civvies understand the rules are there for a reason? Alright. Hello. What the hell are you even? That's the coolest shell you can have. Holy. Excuse me, what is this building? 
Behold, little one. You stand before the new Corsinia Museum of Corsinized History, I say. Oh, neat. Can I go in? Apologies, but the museum is currently closed to the public while we're finishing... We put the finishing touches on a new exhibition. Oh, hey. I'm looking for a tall shark who stole my shell. You seen anyone like that? Mm, I can't say I have. But if I travel here to fence stolen goods, I saw it in the lower crust down, be down beneath us. Gotcha, thank you. Be careful down there, I say. Oh, I wanted to see the museum. You see this here? Best view in the lower crust. I'll be honest, it just looks like a stinky alleyway to me. Aye, the very stinkiest. Bring a theater to one's eye, don't it? Oh, okay. Is that a... Oh, I can't grab onto this. That's a leg. To be uh, had a job up top side. Big thing helps some well to do family with some trash moving. There was a fine fella who seemed to make a shin on me, shining on me. Sometimes I wonder what he's up to. I was waiting for you, my friend. Go get him, you know. What the? Just taking it one day at a time. Maybe one day I can afford to take it a whole week at a time. I'll get my hopes up though. Why don't you want a shell? You're cold. Just waiting for the right one, I suppose, kid. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, that actually scared the shit out of me. What the fuck? The end is nigh. Now I tell you. Nigh. Here there, young man. I trust you've made proper preparation for the apocalypse. The apocalypse what? Oh dear, oh dear, dear, dear. The ignorance of your youth. The apocalypse. The end of all things big and small. Cities collapsing, crabs devouring crabs, fish learning how to drive. And of course, the gunk. The, the, the gunk? Indeed. No one knows where it comes from. But it can appear whenever the crabs call home and chokes the life out whenever it spreads. And surely before long it will cover the entire city. That sounds horrible. What should I do to prepare? I have no idea. I was really hoping you did. That's why I approached you. Huh. Uh, are you sure? You know what you're talking about? I don't see any gunk in the city. Call me crazy, are you? You'll see. You'll all see. Uh, is, it, is that yours? A manta? Yeah, Collie? What are we doing? Like, right now? Like, right now? We're hanging out with the crystal. Hanging out with the crystal? Yeah. You want to do anything after this? I know another cool crystal on the other side of town. We could go hang out by that. You're the best. Hey, manta? Yeah, Collie? That guy broke a cool crystal. No way. Just walked right up and broke it. I have to live and let live, Coley. No idea. Life really isn't what it used to be. Wanna go find another cool crystal? I sure do. Can't let jerks like that ruin your chill. So true. I'm, I'm, I'm very sorry. I need that. Oh my god. Uh, hold up. Oh my god, ow! That shit <laughs> I was not expecting that to hurt me.
I need all the cool crystals I can get, okay? What the hell is this, though? Oh, mate. How do I get up there? Wait a second. I am not entirely sure what I'm doing. And I don't remember where the treasure I saw other oh, is. was a way to the crystal. Nice. Alright. 66. We can probably go and buy a couple of skills now. Another limpet. Still not entirely sure what, um, what we're using these things for. I guess one day we'll be able to sell them, maybe. There's so much treasure around, around town. Holy crap. to the bottom feeders and to the blacksmith I'm gonna quickly teleport sorry shellaport to the okay to the moon moon snail Genesis as ever, the noble moon still provided the pupil with additional powers. Cool. Okay, so this is the one that turns my weapon into a powerful hammer. That sounds good, right? The next one is 65. The hermit crab finds himself unsatisfied with his makeshift weapon. Seeks greater strength, more ability to crush his enemies, as they find himself crushed. And he has quickly discovered that the best defense can be as a powerful offense. I also kind of like the house room, but we need one more. All the charge attack. Just stick a shell to the weapon. It deals a lot of damage and capsize them quickly, but we'll use up the shell's health. That's fine. to the crust right let's try the blacksmith look at this guy holy crab
Oh, there's scrap. It's a hammerhead. It's got a prosthetic claw. It's a fine piece of metal in your claws there. Lots of problems. Can you make it shine by me, scrap? Make it shine? You mean my fork? It's just some piece of junk I found in my neighborhood. Aye, and what a piece of junk it is, scrap. Bring this old Smith's umbrella so you can break down. And I'll show you what that junk or yours can truly do. Sounds useful. Upgrade fork. One stainless relic to improve your fork. Yes. Do I have any? This fork upgrade to level 2. Plus 5 attack. Holy shit. Okay. Have you seen my shell? I almost don't want to ask, but... The big church shall come here trying to sell a shell for scrap. Yeah, but that probably seemed crazy to you because the shell was super gorgeous and cool. I he came by. Turned the shell to scrap as soon as I could. What? Uh, are you serious? You're a seafoam, I am. Nah, no, wait, you said a shark? Oh, scrap that, my mistake. No shark came by, nay. What? What did you guys say? You almost gave me a heart attack. I need to shout, Scrap. Me is work just fine. Okay. Alright, plus one, huh? Is that the fork upgrade? No extra stowaways. Which is weird, because we have... Two. There has to be a way to... Upgrade the stowaways. Guys, hold on a second. I keep hearing like noises from outside. I have to figure out what's going on. Okay, there's like two idiots in the middle of the road, under the rain, with no umbrellas and their dog. They've been there talking for the last like half an hour. I don't even know. <laughs> hey there, young'un. Welcome to Bottom Feeders. Find this little watering hole this side of the slurry. Hi, uh, my name is Creel. I'm new to town, I guess. Thought I recognized a fresh face. Please, there's plastic to meet you, Krill. Name's Nemma. If you got the money, why not stop in for a bite? My kids and I would love to have you. They also offer a stowaway hiring service. If you're interested in such a thing. Oh, yeah? What's a stowaway? I mentioned something about stowaways. What are those? Oh, I'm sure you've seen them around. That's a nickname for any sort of little fella that sticks itself to your shell, little fella. Oh, like a barnacle? Exactly. And for the right price, there's all sorts of them that might tag along. People pay for that? They should do, hun. Lots of visitors here to travel or just stopping by who could use a little company on the road. You have to consider it if you've got a journey ahead of you. Your open ocean can get mighty lonely, hun. I'll think about it, thanks, ma'am. Oh, call me Nemo, hun. I'm not a crabby old lady just yet. Increase stowaway capacity. That's so much microplastic. What the fuck? So I can sell these things. Okay. Higher. A razor blade. Minus 33% attack speed, but increased... Uh, sorry, minus 33% attack, but increased attack speed. A lug nut. Extra attack, but reduced attack speed. Packing peanut, take no damage from falling into the abyss. I need that. <laughs> I, 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 I think I need the packing peanut. Used bandage, healing effectiveness, also pretty good. Lamprey, requires 28 attack. Holy shit. Health drain, that sounds pretty good though. 
Fruit sticker. Piece of adhesive plastic often found attached to edible fruits increase microplastic rewards. Also very good. Welk plus. Shell spell damage. The sinker. Heavy weight capable of dragging trash and creatures alike down the depth. Attacks deal 20% balance damage. Huh. Not too shabby. Another crab. Rhymes with once upon death at the cost of the stowaway. Oh no. It's a sacrifice ring. <laughs> a sad dollar. Vanishes on death or prevents the loss of microplastics. I see. Well, some of these are actually helpful, like the fruit sticker, the lamprey, and the uh, packing peanut. But man, everything costs so much around here. Hey, um, if it's not too much of a bother, I'm looking for a shark that took my shell. Any chance to stop by here? Pretty sure I'd remember a fellow like that swimming into my establishment. Sorry, kiddo. That's okay. Uh, uh, no worries. Okay. So, I've, I've been everywhere. It's gotta be somewhere. I just gotta find where the shark went. The city's so big. How am I ever gonna find my shell? This place is so stupid. And it's loud. Why couldn't everyone just leave me alone? Yeah, I, I get you, guy. Okay. That's what I say every day. <laughs> in, my, in real life. Everywhere I turn, someone's trying to take something away from me. Or send me some kind of... Scuttle right up, fellow citizen. It's Pronaton. It's the grand opening of the prawn shop. Full of legitimate shallows made wares. We got plastics, we got metals, we got packing foam. They got garbage you ain't ever heard of yet. What the? That my shell? That my shell. I can recognize that band aid everywhere. The fuck? That That's my shell. Are you serious? This guy's still following me? Wait, is this a shark guy? Alright, play it cool. I don't know what you're talking about. Seriously, give that back. It was stolen from me by a jerk shark. Well, first off, that shark seems super cool and chill to me. That's him. That's the shark. This guy's the shark. Second of all, he uh, sold it to me fair and square. If you want it back, you gotta buy like everything else in the store. That's how the, pa the prawn shop works, baby. Well, how much? And uh, what can I actually pay with? Depends what you got, pal. I've got microplastics, I guess, and some string. Look, that shell's really important to me. Could I work it for it or something? I'll do anything. Anything, huh? Yeah, I guess I could probably come up with some arduous and meaningless time sink for you to partake in and earn your shell back. Status, why don't you scrape the barnacles off my sweaty... Wait, wait, did you hear that? Hey, what? I like this conversation, kid. Try shouting this here. This always catches me off guard. I gotta get ready before I miss out on some prime plastics. Hey, I'm not done talking to you. Trash day! It's trash day! Everyone get your baskets! Don't miss out! Oh, it's that big trash island that's in the ocean. Right, look how happy all these crabs are. Back off! I saw it pushed! Get your own trash, lump suckers! Man, I should throw more stuff in the ocean, huh? That's uh, that's the moral of this game. We need to throw more things into the ocean. What is that thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's a message from the captain. It's got his face right on it. It's gotta be. Excuse me. Excuse me, please. Pardon me. Excuse me, young lady. As new Cassinia's official historian, I'm sure I can shed some light on... My God! If I'm not mistaken, this is part of a map! A map showing the way to a most valuable treasure, I say! If someone were to find its missing yeah. pieces and decipher them, why, they'd be rich beyond their wildest dreams, I say! Rich? I like the sound of that. That treasure's as good as mine. I'll be able to afford the flashy shell in the ocean, you know? Not if I get there first! Think of all the tourists that treasure can bring to our city! Well, don't you count out us, bottom-siders. You'll be eating your hat when I get that treasure and fix up my restaurant! 
It would appear the hunt is on, I say. The first stop on the map seems to be the forest to the north of here. May the best, Crab! Apologies for the interruption, folks. I seem to have misheard something. I could have almost sworn there were some citizens here planning on unearthing some valuables. Need I remind you all how threatening the ocean is outside this reef? I'd hope it would go without saying that the duty of such a dangerous excavation would fall to the Shellfish Corporation. That would be safest for all involved. Don't you agree? Yeah, we, we hear you, Roland. No, no problem. Then, as Shellfish Corp CEO in this fair city's de facto mayor, I suppose no one would have any objections to my taking sole control of this treasure hunt. Are we all in agreement? Oh, oh dear. I, I suppose that sounds all right with me, I say. You hear what they're talking about over there? Sounds like some kind of crazy treasure hunt. Hey, kid, I just got an idea. If you can go get that treasure they're jawing about, I'll gladly trade your shell for it. For, for real? You'd really do that? You bet. A prawn never goes back on his promise. Aw, yeah! I'm gonna find that treasure! Is that a gun? <laughs> yeah, you that go, potty kid. popper? Rolling can't tell us what to do. That treasure belongs to whoever can find it first. The corporations don't control us! I suppose a little friendly competition is only fair. I hope you know what you just dove into, kid. See you in the open ocean, treasure hunters. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Hold up, was she wearing like a, uh, like a bag of like those little silicone balls that they put in uh, products to dehydrate them to soak up the humidity? Dang, that was crazy with capital Z. You really stepped in it now, kid. That squid that hangs around Roland doesn't think twice about disappearing people. Y you told me to. You need a lot of balls to dry out this place? Yeah, probably. You can try though. Hey, I recall merely making merely making a suggestion, pal. But the offer still stands. If you can get me that treasure, the shell is all yours. Okay, well, where do I start? When you listen to that old dude, it's off at the grove way north of here. You've got a bit of walk ahead of you. Great. Well, I guess I have no choice now. I'm on this treasure hunt, whether I like it or not. Oh yeah, one more thing. If you find any other junk out there, I'll take it off your hands with some, for some microplastics. Fair is fair. Okay. Stainless, right? Like, holy... Okay, we need that. Oh, also blossom our limbs. We help those. Is that the... Is the sprout the one that allows me to carry one more? That's also very useful. Shark egg. I don't know what that is. Oh, my shell is very expensive, guys. <laughs> we need a billion dollars <laughs> to, to buy my home back. Just a couple of great sessions away. <gasps> We can sell all this. A pristine pearl. That was a pearl of the uh, the, the, the lady that I was supposed to sell. To, sorry, to give to the Duchess. What do we do with it now? Is it really junk to sell? I can sell all these things, and I already made like a ton of money. Which I'm gonna use to buy. Uh... I'm tempted to just buy a stowaway space. Is 
Stay never sort of hits useless because we need two anyway, so that's not useful. I guess a sprout is not a terrible idea. Let me see. Desiccant silic gel. Throw away do not eat. Yeah, it's those little <laughs> baggies. Nice. Hey. Well, that was quite the clamor, I say. It's not every day you see someone go claw to claw with Roland. I didn't know I was going to cause such a commotion. Oh, well, if you ask this old man, it's about time someone stood up to that bully. He's been attempting to pave over my museum for God knows how long. But I digress. We gotta, we gotta get a move on if you want to beat Roland to the punch. As I said, the first stop on our journey is the Grove. Head out of the city and keep traveling north. You'll reach it eventually. Just take care not to get devoured, I say. Yeah, sounds good. Oh yeah, this is gonna rule. A real chance to go up against my idol Roland. Your idol? You like that guy? Of course I do. He's a business genius, you know. Roland came into this town with nothing. Save the clothes on his back and a trash scavenging empire that goes back generations. Ah. And he built that empire into a somewhat bigger empire, all on his own. Why go after the treasure if you think he's so cool then? Ha, you really don't know the first thing about business, kid. I sure respect Roland, but we're also in the same market and that makes us rivals. The free market demands I do my best to up one-up him. That's the spirit of healthy competition. Fair enough. Just drifted into town and you're already making waves, kiddo. If it wasn't for you, we'd all have just rolled over and let Roland step all us over, like usual. So, so we're all going after this treasure then? Seems like it. If that old timer who runs the museum ain't pulling our clothes, whoever gets that treasure is gonna have some serious pull around town. But honestly, as long as someone gets it that ain't Roland, most of us would be darn pleased. Who's that guy anyway? Why does everyone hate him so much? Roland? Only the CEO of Selfish Corp. The largest trash scavenge operations out there. Besides, well, a few dependent traders haul in with their own two claws. All trash that makes its way into New Corsinia goes through Roland. So it's got some deep pockets. Shellfish Corp. Owns most of the buildings in town by now. And charges a pretty plastic for the privilege of living in them. Those of us down in the lower crust? You can say we ain't really fans of the way things are going. So, taking him down a peg by waving some treasure in his face? I can think of a lot worse ways of spending a tide or two. But enough about Roland, we gotta make tracks towards that treasure. That museum curator told us uh, to go ahead towards the Grove, right? I've been to the Grove before. Meet me just out of town if you need a nudge in the right direction. Okay. Who are you? Heavens, what excitement! I'll be taking along with your little treasure hunt. I simply must document for uh, for my followers. Oh no, fucking influencer. What followers? You know, followers. People who follow me around just desperate to know what I'm up to. You mean to tell me you don't have any? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I've real left treasure hunt. This is the sort of things you read about in books as a little crablet. Do you think we'll fight a shark? Or a worm? Or one of those horrendous monstrosities that live on the deepest depths of the drain? I really hope not. Jesus Christ, why nobody told me about the monstrosities? Alright. Um. I mean, I still need to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're running the show while Mum's on the go. I can help you hire more stowaways. If you want to carry more at once, you should talk to my little sister. Hey, hey, hey. We're watching the bar. While Mum's away. I can help increase the number of little guys on your shell. You want to wanna buy more little guys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Microplastic, 250. All right. One more? 5,000? Yeah. All right. Thank you. Heck yeah, three out of five, okay. 
Uh, we're going to have plus 10 defense, more vitality, more spell damage. Probably not worth it. A little bit of extra attack. Uh, I say other 10 defense or more vitality. That's... That's a decent chunk of health, isn't it? But I don't want to become dependent on it, so I think I'll use the barnacle for now. I already have one. Oh boy. I mean, sure, it's gonna allow me to expand the, the stowaway capacity, but I can only equip three at a time. And I basically already know which one I'm going to use at some point, so. Uh, how do I go back up? Wait. There you go. All right, time to go. Do we have any leftover that we can use? Or levels? Not really. Okay. Let's just go. Man, what an adventure. You can afford a party hat insurance. Do we really need that though? I don't, I think I don't. But the hat is a little bit flimsy, you know, that's the problem. Like, it breaks very quickly. What are all these people doing here? Oh, they're all trying to get to the treasure, huh? Alright. She uh, could have a little pet sardine. That's so cute. Oh my god, no way. What's up? I totally feel exactly the same way about sardines. No way. You wanna kiss a little bit? What? What? Huh? Huh? <laughs> what? Is it better or worse than being naked? We're never naked. Whenever we spawn, there's always like a shell nearby. It's like the game is designed to give you shells even if you if you die. Maybe you can't choose which one you have, but you're always gonna have one. It's not really a big deal. Trash Day still finds a way to surprise me after all this time. If only be to swim all the way up to Trash Island as it passes by. I bet you don't come back to the richest crab in town. But no one's that strong for a swimmer. In worst case scenario, you just get stuck up there. Do I jump down? What am I doing here? Oh, Jesus. That's kind of shit. I think I jumped down. Roll and roll and roll and roll and what? Roll and roll and roll and roll and. There they are. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold your seahorses, Kato. Look, we're technically rivals in this treasure hunt thingamajig, but that don't mean I want to see you get devoured before my eyes. What did I do wrong? Look, there's rules to explore in the sands between. Namely, steps you gotta take from preventing him from slurping you right out of the shell and eating your hole. See these arches? What's a commute from here? I've done a pretty good job of scenting routes to the nearby areas. Scenting? I know sense that he ain't a fan of. No matter how tasty you are, he won't pass near the path. Wait, who are we talking about? Who's this guy? Look, just stick to the arches, okay, kiddo? And if you get chased, make your way back to one as quick as you can. C can do? What the fuck are you talking about? 
Let's see what about this treasure hunt after all. Of course I am. This is my only way to get my shell back. Please don't take offense, but I half suspect that you'd lose your nerve, I say. The sense between are no place for an innocent crab. Whatever, I'm super brave. Let's just get this over with so I can go home. Put me in the right direction. Oh, you might have what it takes after all, child. It's a willingness to run off and get killed in the name of discovery. Brings a tear to my eye, I say. This is new here, I'll give you an overview. To the north is the Enchanted Grove. Once a reclusive village of spiritualists. East of here is the Floatsand Vale, the company town of Shellfish Corp. And west? I wouldn't go west without a good reason. Not that it matters, the captain map has pointed us north towards the grove. Maybe there, and we can discuss the next step. Yes, sir. Okay. Right. Ah. Uh. Ooh, a yokult. Probiotic. Ooh, I like probiotics. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Pagurus the Ravenous? Wait, is that him? Oh shit. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wait. Huh? I don't think I strayed too far from the path. Did we kill this guy already? Oh. Jesus fucking Christ. I don't even know which one is the path. God. Oh god. Ow. I thought this was safe. <laughs> I don't know which one is the scented path. You're cold. Wait, was there something marking the ground? Oh, is this the scent? Crab doesn't even smell? I don't know. Pak Pakurus can. Pakurus the Ravenous surely can. Drunken Claw. stuff back at least oh, fuck. Shit, 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 shit. <gasps> I'm frightened oh god this broke down oh I'm so dead Unless he's stuck there. <gasps> no, he's not stuck. Oh, fuck you now. 
<laughs> yes, please help me. <laughs> At least I looted everything, okay? What do you mean? I thought I was safe on those little specks of... <gasps> oh my god. Okay. I have to be safe. This, this is not safe. I honestly don't know what to look for. Probiotic is a is a region. That is actually incredibly good. Maybe there's only one path. Yeah, but like, I thought this was marking the path, but I guess it isn't. Thimble. I'm not entirely sure. I think these things are marking the path. Like, this honestly looks like nothing. <laughs> Definitely does not look like a path, I'd say. Oh my god, these guys. You guys don't want to fuck around with what's going on here. You look like a path. No, you. Ow. Piece of... <gasps> no, 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 no. Pagurus, please. Pagurus, please. Pagurus. I... Oh, my God. Grey Fox, by the way. Is this safe? I don't know what is safe and what isn't. I feel like I want to figure out a way to cheese Bogurus and kill it, though. You piece of absolute garbage. God. No way. Phytoplankton. It's a stowaway. A family of fun sized photosynthetic friends. Consuming a hardcore pot regenerates a small amount of umami. Okay. I need a new shell. Hello. 
Wow, we. This is the farthest I've ever been from home by a country fathom. Oh, this is Tortellini. Check it out. You can even see the grove from up here. This is going to be a swell adventure, I can already tell. Where's the grove? Is that the grove? The chain? I don't know. Might be. Okay. Take. I don't want to venture too far into the depths. Got bad news if you're heading to Flotsam Vale. The path here hasn't been maintained in ages. From here on to the entrance, there's no more Santa markers. Just to make a break for it and keep your claws crossed. You saying this is Baguru's territory? It is. Yeah, I ain't doing that. There is actually fired one of the community managers now, making progress. Good, which one is it? Is it the one that accused the other guy of sexual assault? Or is it the one that told everybody to fuck off and ban people at random? The random banner, I see. Well, good for them, you know. Honestly, I would have fired every single one of those community managers because they honestly handled it so badly. But hey, one, I guess it's better than nothing. That's Bogurus. What the fuck am I doing here? Uh, I am not sure where to go from here. There's no road, there's no scent. I don't understand how to find the scent. You got a game with a million players, probably it's time to get actually trained people to handle your community rather than ascend it into the genies. Yeah. Uh, you should definitely get professionals at that point. <laughs> Guys, I have no idea where to go. Guess this way? There's enemies. Oh shit. Okay. <gasps> the party hat. See, the problem with the party hat is that the fence is very low. It does give me two temporary uh, umami power, I suppose. The thimble. And that would be Maguros. God damn it. Ignore the oh, okay. I'm not gonna ignore this guy, I suppose. Fuck off. 
really? <laughs> Give me your party hat. I'm dying. I need better healing. Are we safe now? Other than this guy following me? Um, I'm a little worried. Is Pagura's gonna follow me up here? Maybe we're good. Hello? Holy crap, you killed a lot of people, huh? You again, vagabond. I am pleased you survived. Oh, I barely recognize you. You're the guy from Slack Tie, right? Nice hat. Indeed. Chitin is my name. However, I shed my title. I was foolish to pledge my sword to a lord so easily swayed by greed. You understand, don't you? The consequences of the fall of Selectide. No one to guard the bridge? Far more serious, vagabond. What annihilated Selectide was an infection. At first I thought a pollution of the ma of the body. Now I suspect it stems from the mind. Regardless, I believe it was the Duchess greed that invited into her lands. And until those like her un are annihilated, the infection will spread and spread and spread. For this purpose, I have arrived at this grove. I see. Eggshell. Hi. Moon snail. Now, I could start leveling up, or I could save for... What exactly? I mean, there's like a million shells, plus insurance, I suppose. Oh, there is really a million shells. There's 69. That's a lot of shells. Okay, we're never using the drunken claw. It's a good shell, though. 30 defense, 95 durability. The probiotic is really good. I mean, that's probably one of the best we've seen so far. Considering we don't get a lot of healing around here. What's this? A mason jar. Three attack, only ten, so this breaks almost in instantly. Because it's uh, glass, I suppose. But I'm gonna grab it just to discover the new shell. Hello? 
te 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 te. The world crumbles beneath us. Do you feel it? What has been built will return to sand, and what was forgotten will re-emerge. Home. Our brilliant home. Te 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 te. Huh? What? Okay, there is no full damage, unless I, you know, uh, get into a pit. Are those arrows? Oh, I'm getting into the grove, okay. Oh, Jesus Christ already. I wanted a pack in peanuts, yeah. Well, I guess it's less useful if... Um if, like, if you can see the ground, there is no full damage. It's only for those areas that are like previous one, I suppose. We'll see how it goes. We, we have time. It was very expensive anyway. Hey, look who it is. Honestly, thought you might die in the sands between, you know? No way. I'm pretty strong. I like your confidence, pal. And at the very least, you've made it this far. The stuff's gonna get rougher from here, you know? Grove used to be a real chill village, full of lovable country bumpkins. Real salt of the sea types. Anyone who gets the paper knows what happened here by now. Just 10 or 20 tides ago, a bunch of them went totally nuts. Foaming at the mouth, saying all kinds of wild stuff. And wouldn't you know it? Those crazy crabs up and killed all the rest of them. That's horrible. Don't lose too much sleep over it. Happens all the time these days. That... That's just really, really bad. Yeah, it's not great. But what can you do, you know? That's life in the sticks. I just got myself lucky for my cozy apartment in New Cosinia, where nothing like that ever happens. I still hear talking. Are they still out there? No, it was just a guy that has his uh, Labrador, and every time he's just walking the dog, he's always on the phone. Oh, shit. What happened to the motorbike guy? I'll be there. It's not, you know, fully summer yet. I, I truly hope at some point they will grow up enough to just, you know, trade in the motorbike for a car and, um, don't bother me with that anymore. Okay. They didn't think they could shoot through the pit thing. Also, they have curving arrows. Oh my fucking god. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> How did I dodge that? Oh, I got killed by- I got sniped with the other one. A watery grave. This place is uh, kind of tough. 